Welcome to this video on how to draw a conic curve in 2D sketch mode of Autodesk Fusion. This is a conic curve defined by the so-called rho value. With rho is 0.5 we have a perfect parabola which is the black line. If we go higher up the triangle rho is larger than 0.5 it's called a hyperbola. If we go with a row below 0.5, it's called an ellipse. Let's enter sketch mode by creating sketch in the toolbar and then select a plane. Let's do this plane. And now hit create and then the conic curve. We first have to select two base points, so let me click over here and over there. Let's make it symmetric uh, for this start. And the third point is the top of the cone. Now we can enter over here the row value. Uh, 0.5 was a perfect parabola. Uh, the strange thing is, normally we could left click on the mouse to exit the tool, but that doesn't work in this case. We have to hit enter and that finishes the, uh, the conic curve, but it also exits the tool. Okay, let's do it again, create conic curve. And let me select these same points and see what happens if we select another row. Well, this is row 0.8, that is uh, nice. And one more time, for the ellipse uh, that is interesting because we can now create a two point a point to point ellipse uh, the ellipse tool itself only allows a center ellipse so this is the method to create a point to point ellipse if you ever need it uh, even though you have to uh, do it twice to make a complete ellipse do these uh, points have to be symmetric? No, they don't. We can also make a conic curve uh, in a very uh, strange way. Uh, let's say from here to there and then uh, to there or even outside. Uh, it depends on what you need to draw and you can move your control points to any location. Um, well, actually, this is it about the conic curve. There's not much more to tell. Maybe uh, a final check, an interesting check, is we also uh, have been creating a parabola with the spline tool, uh, with the control point spline. Let's see for fun if that has the same uh, parabola. I don't know. Yes, it looks like it is exactly the same parabola here in the middle. We can't even see it anymore now, but that uh, works perfectly fine. A parabola can be drawn with a spline tool or with this conic curve tool. This was it. Maybe see you back in a future video. And in the meantime, have fun.